Et salut à tous, on se retrouve. Attends. Ah ok, on s'en fout. On se retrouve pour un nouvel épisode de Red Dead Redemption 2. Et on retrouve Dutch au bureau du shérif. C'est parti. Of course, of course. Oh. And here is my dear friend, Arthur Callahan. Boy is a hunter. Boy is a killer. Arthur, you've met, but not been in... Mais joli le flingue du mec, là. J'aime beaucoup oh, la couleur du bois. I'm so sorry. Sheriff. Great. How are le mec you doing, sir? I'm fine. Tough business you boys had. We did? Oh, there's no need to pretend with me, sir. Life can be tough. So it can. And no man owes another anything. No, sir. But still, I feel you were hard done by losing your employment like that. But still, here in Rhodes, we have work enough for honest men. Oh, that's some strong stuff. Still, don't seem to be doing you any harm, I guess. Exactly. Whoa. Excuse me a moment. He's so shit. I told you we was moving up in this world. Deputies. You have finally <laughs> lost your mind. Amongst these drunkards, hillbillies, and slavers? Good honest thieves like us. We're bound to be moralizers in a place like this. Oh, Sheriff Gray, you are back. Now listen, sir. There is shine in them woods, though. And it is cost in this county its good name. And the state a whole lot of income. You boys wouldn't mind rooting it out. Maybe we'll make you permanent. I gotta set me down a second. Not a problem, sir. Not a problem at all. You are in safe hands now. And people waste time with the temperance movement. Liquor never dulled a good man's senses. Arthur, you ride with the deputy. Bill and I will follow. Climb on up. Let's go. Archibald? How are you? Pretty good. And your friend is behaving himself? Oh, uh, yes. Uh, I think he's learned his lesson. Congratulations on becoming a temporarily deputized citizen of Scarlet Meadows County. Most towns just get bounty hunters to do their dirty work these days, but Sheriff Gray believes the law should keep the law. Now, I'm sure I don't need to remind you there's a chain of command here. There is? Dang straight there is. This is a dangerous business, but follow my lead and you'll be just fine. Sure. Hey! Archibald wants to remind us he's in charge here. Of course. Who else would be? You were a big help with them Anderson boys, and I put in a very good word with the sheriff on your behalf. We appreciate that. We rounded up the others soon after. I'm pushing for the rope myself, but that's by the by. So, these moonshiners. Not just any moonshiners. Braithwaites. I told you about the Braithwaites. Pretty sure you did. Old Cotton family had a fortune at one point until, well, a few changes in the labor laws. Now they're dealing in moonshine. We found their stills hidden all over Lemoyne. Quick as we destroy one, another one pops up. You could call it a pitiful fall from grace, if they had any grace to start with. I have no time for tax dodgers. Not to mention the fact that Catherine Braithwaite has a rather expensive interest in thoroughbred horses to maintain. But I heard something about it being gold these families were fighting over. Well, that's the rumor. But the Greys and the Braithwaites think the others stole a fortune from them. But it happened so long ago, I don't know for sure if it's true. Must be tough being rich, huh? <laughs> so I imagine. That bed rather suits you, Mr. W. Yes. I thought so, too. Does it feel good to be back at it, serving your country? I wouldn't go that far. Whoa! Whoa! Hold up. You see that wagon? Oh. These damn flies! 
sont mortes depuis un moment. Ça a quand même 2-3 jours, hein, je pense. Hey, come have a look at this. Look, suit and tie, one bullet clean through the forehead. Well, my money says this is the handiwork of a gang called the Lemoyne Raiders. Yeah, I've run into them. Let's see if we've got any identification. Ah oui, il a vraiment l'étoile de shérif. Hein? Okay. We should get pas vu le going. I'll send someone over here later to clean this up. What the fuck? Monte là. Voilà. Would you mind taking the reins? I want to have a look at these papers. Sure. I'll direct you. Yep. Oh merde, c'est pas ça que je voulais faire. Okay. Frederick Mitchell. Lemoyne State Legislator. Poor feller. Easy. We ain't in that much of a hurry. Go right at the crossroads. Yep. Not the nicest fellers in my experience. Oh, and I know the Braithwaites are in business with them. No shame. They're right again here. Trash begets trash, my Uncle Reginald used to say. He had a few stories, let me tell you. Town preacher and town sheriff. The drink a sailor under the table before... Hey, hey, not so fast! Son chien a dit ça, je hand, like a child, on the end of a grown man's arm. Here we are. So what was I saying? Something about the Braithwaite, I think. Even saying that word makes me sick. Now, anyone we find here, we bring in a lot of under... Faut que je vous montre un truc. J'ai tuné le fusil de sniper, regardez. Il est beau, il est vraiment beau. See, see, what did I tell you, boys? What did I say? I said this place was crawling with vermin, and we just knows the rat's nest are excellent, as they say in Paris. My aunt, she went to Paris back in 78. How handle this? Well, the way I see Actually, let my friend here decide. He doesn't have your fine way with words, but he is definitely the man for the job. Let's split up. Arthur and Bill, me and Archibald. You boys want right or left? We'll take the left. Let's stop these filthy degenerate tax dodgers. Remember what he said. We need them alive. Let's just knock them out and then tie them up. Got it. See one by the bridge over there? There's another one by the still.
sont bien habillés pour des contrebandiers. Tu mets la main au cul. Oh shit. Attends, je vais le noyer. C'est sûr qu'il y a besoin d'explosifs de, Parce que je pense que si on tire de là-dedans, ça explose de ouf, hein, mais bon. Les revolvers de double action, c'est le feu. Hein. C'est trop bien le double action Qu'est-ce qui se passe What the fuck J'ai abandonné... Qu'est-ce que c'est que ça encore Je fais 3 mètres... Oh mon dieu Tellement bien les doubles actions, putain. Je suis bloqué. Ils ont tellement de stuff, putain Ça me fait chier de les laisser quand même, hein. Regarde, ils ont trop de trucs sur eux. Bon, bah voilà, ils me laissent les fouiller, finalement. Bon, je vais pas tout fouiller non plus. Bon, 
bas le coffre, je peux pas l'ouvrir là Non Bon bref, allez on y va. Allez. Ah ouais, le double double action justement, c'est incroyable. <rire> well, forgive me, but me and my men must return to our lives. Ah. Seems like we failed to destroy the last of the moonshine. Sure. Would you like us to? Well, I normally take it for personal consumption, it's sort of part of the job. But I better get back home. Why don't I just take a jug or two and leave you boys the rest to show that there's no hard feelings on account of the war? We are all Americans. Of course. My cousin, Webster, he used to say some of us is not as American as others, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Only I didn't, quite. Come on, you degenerate, no good, white trash, hillbilly piece of scum. I know you, Billy Lime. Finally. You've always been a Finally. piece of crap. Come on, move. We have a life. Move on a land so stupid, a backwater so backwards that even we are like geniuses. <laughs> <laughs> Bill, get this stuff out of here. Come on, you ride with me. Okay. You ride with me. J'adore leur accent. Yes, show it to Hosea. I'm sure he can find a use for it. Bit of trouble back there, Arthur? Ain't there always? From what they was yelling, I think they were the buyers. Old Archibald didn't ask too many questions, so neither should we. I ain't planning to. Oh, le pélican. Oh, j'avais envie de le fumer. C'était beau. In plain sight. These lawmen, these two families. I mean, I don't really think we can play this from all sides. It's got Jose written all over it. This is starting to sound like the yep. I'm Dutch again. What do you mean? Gosh, I'm as strong as I have ever been. Hey, you know what? Why don't I race you back? Ah, je peux pas. Bon, bah, let's go. Attends, je vais lui répondre. Okay, you're on. That's the spirit. Okay, on my word. Set, go. You yep. never were much of a rider. C'est mort, hein. tu vas pas me doubler, mon pote. Ça. Yeah. 
Allez, Dutch, rentre chez toi On le voit même plus C'est beau. Distillation à l'américaine. Alors c'était quoi les... Terminer la mission sans vous faire toucher. 10 tirs en pleine tête. Ok. Vous avez fait... Hello, on va pas s'arrêter là quand même. C'est quoi ce petit logo là Attends, on va zoomer. C'est quoi ce petit logo nul C'est Jack. Ah oui, c'est vrai, faut que j'aille voir Jack. Pour lui donner son livre. Hey J'aimerais bien pouvoir gueuler à, tra à travers tout le camp, tu sais. Jack <rire> You like the new camp, Reverend? Oh, yeah. We must, though, didn't we? Whatever you do, don't follow in your pa's footsteps. What does that mean? <laughs> Start to faire chier. I'm only kidding around. I don't understand. Ah, reviens, Jack! Stop it! Mais! Mais il est con? Il est complètement con? Jack Mais T'es un attardé là T'es comme ton père hein Jack Prends ton putain de livre Tu m'énerves Eh je vais te rentrer dedans. Attends, attends que je puisse courir. Je vais te rentrer dedans. Ah voilà. Do you want to have this? I found it near camp. Ah, ok, c'était bugué. Thanks, Jack. J'attendais que ça. Alors, qu'est-ce qu'il m'a donné? Oh, mais il est trop mignon. Il est trop mignon. Bon, bref, je vais le laisser tranquille. Il va encore croire que je vais le violer. Euh, du coup. Mr. Pearson. Molly Yoshi. Molly. Tiens, on va faire la mission de Molly. Puis après, on s'arrêtera là. Par contre, il ouais, y a un truc qui me rend ouf, c'est on peut pas courir, en fait. Euh, dans le camp. Et ça, ça me rend ouf. Je suis bugué. Je suis bugué. Je suis bugué Ok. My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner! Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! <laughs> Enough! Both of you! Well, come with me then. You wanna head out there? Run with the man? So be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. Do you need anything, Mr. Pearson? <laughs> Maybe me and Mrs. Abbott are gonna take a little ride. Yeah, sure. Here's my list, and can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. 
Are you coming with me then, woman? <rire> tu viens avec moi, femme? <rire> so I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. Hello. Oh yeah. Ah, on peut pas le dire. You cool down then yet? I guess. But I ain't no skull yet. And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating halfwit. I guess we all gotta do our share, princess. Oh, where's that letter? You reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. There. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time, so I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Oh, <laughs> wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> you ever actually even talk to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's Dutch's idea. All male to be sent to the same alias. Whatever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. <laughs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. Okay, here we are. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you... No! You insane? I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws, not idiots. We rob fools and rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy us some food to eat. No guns. You're sure? This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. Hey! Surveiller qu'il fasse pas de conneries. Mister, look, it's a ointment, all right, for a private matter. God, really nice to go. Don't make any mistakes. How's your run? Oh dear. Can I help you, Mister? Yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. Oh no, ça me fait chier. Je vais en faire. Je suis pas payé. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Bye now. Je suis sûr qu'elle a fait une connerie. Ah mais c'est un instrument de musique cette merde. Ah folks. Ok bon bah il veut plus en jouer. I'm working. What is taking you so long? Listen, lady, I got an old wagon there. I could train my goat to do this faster. Tina found herself a necklace in Jim's pocket the other day. Ruby the size of a fist. I sure hope you're kidding. I think this is everything. Thanks. Here. Take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. Well, give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. T'as vu, elle a changé. Euh... A changé de vêtements, il me semble. Hein. 
And some new clothes, I see. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair baking cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you... You know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's... Can nothing for me ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Please. Hey there! Hey. What, uh... What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lamorne Raider country. Keep it cool. You Steve. need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey! How's about this? Go! Go, go, go! Non, ça m'énerve de jamais avoir de sang froid là, c'est casse-couille sérieux. Ça dit, tu devrais prendre l'habitude de toujours fouiller ce que tu butes. Je peux, j'ai pas le droit de le fouiller lui. Non. C'est celui qui s'est fait renverser par le chariot, je sais pas. Ça, ça veut pas. Ah mais ça moi de rentrer Oh là là. Elle a dit je vais nous drive euh, je vais nous conduire et tout et... Ah 
pas si vite, Arthur De toute façon, je peux pas aller plus vite, là. C'est le chariot qui va tout seul ici. Hein. Ok. C'est beau hein, de nuit, putain. Franchement, avec les lumières et tout. I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> We got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And the nice pants, What the? by the way. Oh, shut up. What the? Oula, oula. Que... Bonjour. Oula. Okay, c'est bon. Ouais, c'est ma précision. Ça, je le savais que c'était ma précision qui allait me niquer. Next time we run an errand together, remind me to pack more bullets. Come on, Arthur. Don't pretend that wasn't kind of fun. <laughs> I guess. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Okay, Arthur. Evening. Merde, c'est pas lui que je voulais voir, c'était Pearson. I posted that letter for you. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Anytime. J'aurais dû le provoquer pour le, le trash talk un peu dessus. Mais il n'y a pas le ragout qui est prêt là C'est quoi ça Ce petit logo. Un jeu du couteau. Vas-y, on va jouer vite fait. Avant de terminer l'épisode. Mise de 10 cents. Here we go. Oh, ça a l'air d'être une galère, ça. J'aurais dû le faire à demain, mais là c'est trop tard pour changer. Mmh. 4-4. Ouais, faut que je fasse à demain. On va passer, on va passer. Il a fait 4. Vas-y, là on va faire plus. Et 1. Oh merde, c'est Q Fils de pute Tout ça pour 20 cents, hein, c'est pitoyable. Bon là c'est quoi du coup Z... ZD c'est ça Ok ZD. Il a fait 4. ZD on fait demain.
Yeah, boy. On rejoue, on peut rejouer Vincennes. Vas-y, on va le faire. Watch and learn. Ah, y a S maintenant, Z. Ah oh ouais, mais non, mais là ça va être chaud par contre. ZSD, ça va être tendu. Hein. Watch and learn. S. Ouais, non, là je vais pas y arriver par contre. Ah, et quand tu mets trop de temps, euh, ok. Ouais, quand tu mets trop de temps, t'as assez chaud. Ouais, là c'est chaud, j'avoue. Allez, je me taille, t'as gagné tes 40 cents. <rire> Avec le son sur la table. <rire> Ok. Yule repas. J'ai faim. Il est là. Hop, bol de ragoût. C'est tout. So you told Jose about the moonshine? Yes, he's got some plan cooking. Good. You okay, Uncle? Yeah, I'm gonna do some sniffing around, see if I can drum up some leads. Well, do it quietly. <rire> bon, du coup, on va s'arrêter là. Merci d'avoir regardé ce long épisode et on se retrouve dans quelques jours pour la suite. Salut.